well, it's not really sunny anymore, but um, at least the bugs aren't bad. It's not raining. And I've got my arts and crafts project. <laughs> I'm uh, So I'm embroidering, this backwards, hold on, there we go. Uh, I'm embroidering the Viking rune alphabet with beads. I don't know if you guys can see that. Um, it's not focusing, but um, so I'm embroidering the Viking rune alphabet onto a strip of linen to be used for a headpiece. I'd hoped to have this finished last year for a millinery class, um, and that just did not happen. Um, so maybe it'll get done in time for Halloween. That could be kind of a cool time to wear it. Two hours later. All right, so I'm going around the tents and I'm harvesting all the webs to make jewelry out of. Um, I do not harm the spiders. They make new webs like every day. I think it's actually every three days. I don't know, the internet says every day, but I spend a lot of time with these spiders. This is the spoop who was eating the bee earlier. Looks like a bee. But he's still munching. He's got this big, beautiful web that he just made today. And I'm like, oh, do I take it? Do you scare me? Yeah, maybe you scare me. Most of the time, the spiders just kind of stay in the corner where they are. But on rare occasion, they run into the middle of the web like, hey, who's touching my web? And I don't know, this one just seems a little aggro. Also like, hey, you paid rent today. The orb weavers have returned to their weaving so I can start capturing spider webs again. And uh, I'll have these pendants up for sale in time for Halloween. Stormy, windy. Ipika loves it. She's sitting in that dirt. The ground is super cold. She's keeping watch. Are you happy that we finally get a break from all the summer heat? Yeah, I brought you to a place where it's cold. You're welcome. Quite the storm just rolled in. Love these new lights. This is good. I'm sad that the moons are broken, but uh, this is good. It was adorable.
All right, so normally there's a good 30 feet of sand over here. And this is the beach where everybody comes to like hang out. But uh, as you can see from all the rain, that is not the case today. Look at this, this is all we got. That's it. Works for her. Look what you found. You found a hedgie in the woods. Here, you bring that with you. You can have it now. Bring it with you. <laughs> bring it with you. Yeah, it's yours now. Come on, bring it with you. <laughs> oh, it's still got the squeaker. Come on, bring it with you. Let's go, come on. <laughs> Raspberry season is upon us. Raspberry season. Okay, so um, this is probably the last time that I'm going to be here this summer before it gets, you know, cold again. So I'm going to go swimming. Yeah, I'm going to go swimming. Um, it's probably going to be quite the polar plunge. That's what I'm assuming right now. But um, we're going to do it. Yep. Because I will be sad if I didn't go swimming in the lake at least once this summer. Do you want to come swimming with me? That guy, she doesn't want to go. Come on, Vivica. Come on. No, get up. No, don't knock the knife. Do not knock the tripod over. Come on. No, don't do it. Don't do it. Oh, Okay, so tonight I'm doing uh, sweet potato and chicken, and I've also got mushrooms and rice. I'm gonna put some goat cheese on top of that. And Vibika, guess what? I love you so much, and mostly, yeah, that is a good dog. Yeah, look at that, look at that good dog behavior. Uh, mostly, this dish makes two servings, and there's only one of me. I don't really have a fridge. I guess I could put it in a plastic bag and put it in the cooler, but more than likely, I'm just going to share this with you because dogs can eat all this stuff. Yeah, we're going to be eating good tonight. You don't even know how exciting this is. Oh, look at the sizzle. I freaking love this thing. This thing's great. It's got like an oven. It's awesome. Thank you. 